Career and Technical Student Organizations, also known as CTSOs, develop citizenship, technical, leadership, and teamwork skills essential for students who are preparing for the workforce and further education. They enhance students' civic awareness and provide opportunities for developing social competencies. The CTE coursework and the student organizations are really nice complements to each other because what they learn in the classroom, they can then apply through their CTSO and um, see that real life application and how what they were learning is really truly relevant to the career or to the activities that they have planned. It definitely showed me that, you know, you could be, you know, doing ag in business and stuff like that, or ag in food science or, or culinary, you know. Everything we do basically has something to do with ag, so it's definitely something that opened my eyes and realized, you know, ag is bigger than just being on a farm and, and growing crops. Students have the opportunity to participate in several CTSOs, including DECA, Distributive Education Clubs of America, FBLA, Future Business Leaders of America, FCCLA, Family, Career, and Community Leaders of America, FFA, HOSA, and Skills USA. The value of being in a career technical organization is that you can become a better person while understanding the community and growing up and like understanding how to be an individual and how this will affect your future. DECA made it a lot easier for me to take my marketing classes since I was already learning from DECA how to do the marketing classes and what I was going to be expected in the marketing classes. FBLA has helped me move on to thinking beyond just the task at hand and on to further things and it also has helped me think on my feet which is going to be important for me in the future. In order to count as a career pathway component, career and technical student organizations do need to follow certain quality requirements. The CTSO must align with the career pathway course sequence and be taught or advised by a CTE licensed instructor within and aligned to the career pathway content. The CTSO needs to have an active state or national charter or affiliation. The CTSO students are involved in activities that align with the pathway, which may include competition, leadership training, and or group projects and volunteerism. You're able to look at what was learned in the classroom and then apply it through partner partnerships with businesses, through community service projects and giving back to the community, and through competition on multiple levels. It's helped give a more leadership opportunity for me, which I've used outside of Skills USA before in the past and plan to use in the future outside. And I've got to work with people I wouldn't really know before, so it's done like teamwork and like team bonding experiences because I wouldn't normally see working with these people. Being involved in HOSA, which is Health Occupations of America, has helped me greatly in developing what I want to do for my career and has also helped me greatly in figuring out what this career actually entails. I've been able to answer many questions that relate to my career field and get hands-on experience through many competitions I've taken which has solidified on what I actually want to do in my career field. To learn more about CTSOs and career pathways in your region, contact your regional career pathways coordinator. You can find their information and more resources on this DPI webpage. <music>